The walls of Lyon tell stories. They transport you through time and space, weaving tales and illustrating myths. When it comes to murals, the French city is the widely acknowledged world leader, although the painters of mural collective City Création have been busy elsewhere in Europe over the past 35 years. Pushed by our relentless urbanization, demand for murals is growing around the world, and as the demand for the pictures themselves grow, so does the need for skilled mural painters. So in conjunction with established art school Emile Cole, City Création has opened the world's first mural painting school, Ecole City. Gilbert Cuden is co-founder of the school and one of the co-founders of City Création. We're not artists, we are mural painter craftsmen. It's very important. That means we are serving a project, serving a place, serving people. We don't do what we really want to do. We do what the place or the people need or want us to do. The walls are the skin of the inhabitants. You have your first skin which defines you, but what defines you just afterwards are the walls of the house in which you live. When people are comfortable in their skin, comfortable in their walls, they don't harm them. When they are comfortable with their walls, they even protect them. But when it is the reverse, when you are ashamed to say where you live, when you are stigmatized by having to give your address, at that moment the place you live, your second skin, makes you ashamed. During the three-year post-bac course, students learn how to take an idea and turn it into a monumental mural. The image is broken down into smaller sections and traced onto squares of transparent paper. Tiny holes are punched along the drawing and then powders blown through the holes, transferring the images onto the wall. First painted in 1987, work has just finished on a 200,000 euro revamp of the gigantic Lyonnais mural Le Mieux de Canu. This is one of the largest murals in the world, at some 1,200 square metres. Eight people have been working on the third version for more than three months. So what's it like to paint a picture this big? Joël Bonhomme is one of the City Création co-founders and artistic director at this site. I think the hardest thing is working in winter on a facade that faces north with no sun. Also, you can't suffer from vertigo, you must be at ease high up, but when you do a job like this, it's almost second nature to climb about and walk on scaffolding. We wanted to update the mural in the same way as the town around it has changed. And one example of this evolution is the Carbonat family, who've appeared in one form or another in all three versions of the mural. In the first mural, I was alone with a bike on my back, and in 1996 we had our daughter. She's now 16, and she was integrated into the mural. But it was still missing our son, who had since been born, and is now 12, and he is on the new wall. I wasn't on the other wall. It was just my parents and my sister when she was little. I saw all my family except me, and it felt a bit strange. Well, we've grown up, come a long way, and here I am with my revision and my college books. Today we're a family with two teenagers, and it's really lovely to see this evolution.